Hey everybody, welcome back to Stack Snacks. I'm John Swicky, and today we're going to look at Higgsfield AI, and we are going to try to generate a couple of videos. So let's get into it. Higgsfield is something that brings together a bunch of different image and video models, as well as their own models. We've got access to Nano Banana here. We've got GPT image. We got Flux, and on the video side. Cling, which has been popular, there I think 2.5 might be the latest. We got VL3, which of course, and then we also have got <clears throat> access to their new model WAN 2.5, and then Higgsfield Animate. So we'll definitely try to take a look at those later as well. So let's take a look at the pricing. We always like to go there. So currently on the Ultimate plan, we get access to all the models unlimited runs I think it looks like that might be only good for a certain amount of time we get access to four concurrent runs 12,000 credits a month and you can go all the way down to nine dollars a month as well and some daily runs I believe as well for some of the models I say we get into it let's try to use their assist here Generate a video prompt for the DLP model with a crash and zoom. Okay. For when 2.5, I want to make an influencer like video that talks about how helpful subscribing, subscribing to Stack Snacks has been for learning AI. Okay, so it's giving me instructions on how to do that. So let's just see. Let's just go right into here. Let's keep it simple. Okay, so nice thing about the WAN 2.5, we get 1080p and we can go to 10 seconds. So pretty cool. Let's go for our short style. Let's see, do I have to upload a video? No, it says optional. The person should be be should look like a streamer and stream more slash podcaster and it should look like a clip from the show from a show okay all right we'll let the prompt enhance and it looks like this is going to cost me 25 credits so let's give it a spin Okay, we got high demand right now, so maybe we should take a pause. All right, I'll try to speed this up for everybody. We'll be back when this is back in action. Okay, so while that's generating, let's make a couple of images while we're waiting. I'm going to try Higgsfield Soul, because that was referenced before. So let's see. Upload an image as a prompt or describe the scene you imagine. Okay, so I want to, I've been wanting to make this thing for my kids. So let's see how this does that. I want high quality. Yep, enhance my prompt. No, no, you can enhance my prompt. I don't want to waste too many credits. Let's do 16 by 9. I want a colorful and bright world called Candy Cane Park. There is a young boy with three cats, one black, one ginger, and one calico. They are walking in a forest that has candy canes and gumdrops. All right, generate. Looks like, see, we get some free credits here. So let's see what we got there. It looks like, too, we can actually add some characters in there. That could be fun later. All right, we got that going. Let's see how our video is. All right, our video is still going, but we got 1080p in 10 seconds. I expect that to take some time. And then our failed for sensitive content. All right, we won't describe the cats. The boy. Let's do maybe a kid. Kid. Try that. All right. All right, let's see what we can do here. Create blank. 
Oh wait, draw to edit. Oh, maybe I should upload something. Sensitive content. Okay. Let's find... All right, so <clears throat> we've got some styles here. So let's do... Okay, giant accessories fun. Let's do that. Can we have someone at a dinner with a giant waffle and wine glass? Okay, let's see what we get there. All right. All right, we're going to do a draw. Oh, no, wait, I want to upload. Can I cancel this? Yeah, let's trash this one. So I'm going to upload a photo. This was an example of what I was trying to create before. Uh, let's do draw to video. All right, let's see. Okay, what if I do text cat brings cookies to cats. Cats bring cookies to cats. All right, let's remove that. Cat starts to eat a cookie. All right, let's just see what that does. Cat starts to eat a cookie. All right? I don't know. We'll see. If this works, then this is how I'm going to edit every video because this is really cool. All right, looks like we got... Oh, okay. I didn't realize there was a thing there. I'm sorry. I think we got our first video, everybody. Okay, this is with... Let's give it a shot. Oh. All right, browser issue here. Hold on. Let's start back up again. Okay, first off, that looks real. That looks, it's very polished. It looks, lighting's impeccable. Audio is, lip movement's good. Okay, we lose a little audio there at the end, but I think we are onto something, so. Right, and I think with a lot of these too, now we have our first one to go off of. And then, Okay, we got our giant, okay, see? <laughs> okay, so we can make a video out of this, okay. And we can make it speak, oh man, this is cool. Okay, let's make a video out of this. So now, where did, where, oh, okay, so I got my reference image. So let's change this, what is this? Oh, it's just the model picker. Okay, so we got our reference image, and let's just say, the person, starts to take a sip of the wine and struggles and then can't figure out how to eat the waffle okay so i can switch off of unlimited mode for faster results let's do that and then we will see and we'll leave this one at five seconds and we'll leave it at 1080p okay very cool okay see oh see now it pops up this is my feed okay sorry everybody Okay, but one thing I will say is their example prompt did use, did have something to catch my eye. So let's go over to my, let's get ChatGPT up for a second. Okay, so for uh, Google VO3, I had some success doing some JSON prompting, so I made a custom project in ChatGPT. So let's see if we can, let's see how JSON prompting works during all this as well. Let's see. Young woman. Oh, see that? So I even converted that to a JSON prompt. Okay, so let's do an example. No, a podcast episode with two people discussing robots. And then a robot enters. Ask them if they want water. So the cool thing is this will help flesh out our prompts a little bit better. All right, let's close out some tabs. All right, so let's remove our reference image. We're going to put our JSON prompt. I'm not going to edit it. We'll just see. We'll do a short version for this one just because we'll only do 480p because I just want to get a generation going. And we'll do widescreen. And all right, we will generate this one as well. And we'll come back and watch our waffle. Okay, I'm pumped for this waffle one. Look how good that quality is. Okay. Let's go. Movements look pretty good. 
Okay, that one, that got a little weird at the end there. I probably should have did that longer than five seconds because... Yeah. But we're learning. Okay, we're learning. Let's see what else we got. All right, let's rattle off a couple more. I'm having a good time. Um, let's do 10 seconds. Let's crank up the quality again. Let's see. A group of people at an office near the coffee machine and one person makes a new pot of coffee and the crowd goes wild and dem demand a speech. We'll go 1080p. I don't know how many credits I have but I am ripping through them probably. I know I'm obsessed with this waffle because look if you look at it there's like a reflection in the syrup which is super cool you can see it you can see her like as she's putting down the fork so super interesting oh you know what we'll do we will oh wait where did my draw to did we do the draw one yet let's go back to that one draw to video oh caddy's a cookie did that not go all right, let's sit on this for a second. Okay, I don't think that went, so let's see. Okay, let's see, let's refresh. All right, I hit the guidelines again, so I think they don't like something about my animated cats or not, when they're not loving it. Um, okay, I think we can wrap this up by, let's do, I think it's time for me to get in there. Let me get a picture of myself. All right, things are still generating, so it's time for one final one. We're going to use me and a horrible picture of myself. We're going to see if we can make that. I also want to make sure I was, I should have probably hit this link first, but let's make sure I was full seam, some simple descriptions. Okay, this is awesome. Oh, hey, they have a free plan, 10 credits a day, so that's cool. I don't think I saw that in the other thing. So what I want to try to do is see if we can get me talking about something. Can you make me talk about how interesting the new Claude 4.5 is? Oh no. I need to write something. I gotta write a better thing here. Can you have me welcoming everyone to Stack Snacks? And thanking them for subscribing. Thank you for signing up. And I hope you have a great day. I don't know. We'll keep it simple. Let's just see. We don't need 1080p of that, so let's dial that down. Okay. So we've got... Okay, so we still got a couple of builds going. All right. We got a couple builds. I guess we'll just wait here and see what we get. All right, while we're waiting for some of our generations to finish, let us try the Higgsfield soul here a little bit. I don't have 20 photos of myself. Okay, I can't do that. At least right now. Very cool though, I'll give him that. That's very cool. Let's go back to that. Then let's go to our character here. We're gonna pick Nicole. We're gonna do a CCTV video. Can Nicole be helping the hamburger? You know, some hamburgers. Oh, my cat's in the screen here. Hamburgers from a diner. Sorry, my cat is attacking my keyboard. But let's generate this. Let's go back to our videos. Oh, I'm nervous. Okay, they zoom. They zoomed in on me. Okay. All right, that's freaking me out. It was a terrible picture. Okay, Nicole is now stealing uh, stealing a hamburger. It's a cool filter though. Cool, cool style. All right. Uh, all right, I got these final two that I'm still. That we're still waiting for. 
Let's see. Uh, I don't want to generate any more because we don't. Okay, we finally got our final runs here. So let's take a look at these and we'll wrap up. So these are my podcasters. Okay, I mean, um, little robot coming in. Pretty good. Now this is a, so I did a couple while we were waiting to just queued them up. This is kind of like a 90s movie kind of scene I was trying to go for. And this one I was trying to get some animation going. And then I want to get some people dancing on a roof. I mean, not bad. And this is one of the example prompts of kind of a gorilla running through the wild here. So, all right, well, let's look at the waffle one more time. <laughs> so, uh, you know, Hicksfield, um, you know, all the talk of the town lately has been Sora. And I think the thing about, you know, kind of what I see with, with from Hicksfield is like, feel like, you know, one, way more options. Even while I was recording this, I saw uh, a WAN 2.5 fast model pop up. And so I think, um, you know, one thing that they have there is it feels is I'm going to go with the word cinematic. A lot of their videos, it, there's a little bit more of a polish to them, I think. Um, you know, still some imperfections as you get there, right? And I think the thing that I've learned over time with videos is prompting is everything in the structure of your prompt and like, you know, kind of um, really describing that scene. And so I think... Um, you know, prompting's everything, and I think, um, like I said, their videos feel very cinematic. Um, you know, it feels like you could do some, some kind of, some kind of work in here. And I think um, I always love two tools that can kind of give you access to all the different models and kind of different, different, you know, different things that way. Because I feel like sometimes too, you want to kind of see what's out there. So I love that fact, and I think. Um, you know, being able to, you can get the, the WAN 2.5 um, and C-Dance and, and Cling models kind of on the $9 monthly end. And some of the videos that I was generating was only like 10 plus credits. So um, you could definitely kind of use a lot with the $9 a month plan, which I think is really cool. And, you know, I think it's just um, definitely a tool that I'm going to probably figure out how to use in my workflow a little bit. Um, I think, you know, there's, um, a lot here and a lot that I haven't even played with. So, um, so check it out. Higgsfield to, uh, Higgsfield AI and their WAN, to, WAN, 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 WAN 2.5 model. Um, super impressive stuff. Super impressive app. Um, you know, I've really had a good time playing with it. So um, I do recommend everybody check this out. Um, and we'll link kind of everything down below in the notes for everybody. So thanks for stopping by. If you guys play anything, generate anything, send it over. Love to take a look. And we'll see everybody next time.